Hey y'all, it's Shani, Certified Feline Training and Behavior Specialist with Wild at Heart. And how do you know if you're reinforcing bad behaviors? If you like free cat behavior videos, click the plus sign and follow me now. A lot of people were asking about the redirection techniques that I offered in my video about getting cats off the counters and whether if the redirection was actually reinforcing the behavior of the cats on the counters versus getting the cats onto the cat tree. Reinforcement needs to happen directly after a behavior occurs. So when you are redirecting your cat using a treat or toy, they are not getting the reinforcement until they are on top of that cat tree. Therefore, you are not reinforcing them on the counter, you're reinforcing them off of the counter and on the cat tree. You're also going to reinforce every time your cat uses a cat tree on their own. So outside of the times where you're redirecting them, every time they use the cat tree, you are going to reward and reinforce it. We also need to give cats a lot of credit. They're really smart, but they're also going to do the least amount of work in order to get that reward. So they're not going to learn that they need to jump on the counter and then jump on the cat tree. They're going to learn that every time they're on the cat tree, they get a reward. This is why redirection works, but it always has to be paired with ignoring. So you ignore the behavior and then you redirect it to the behavior that you want to see. So you cannot yell at your cat or say anything to your cat when they jump on the counter. You need to absolutely ignore it because remember, if you say something, that is reinforcing. Ignore the behavior, redirect them onto the cat tree, and then give them the reward. Your cats will absolutely learn. You have to be super consistent though, and do it all the time, every time. And yes, some cats are going to struggle to learn this, but I guarantee you your cat can learn this. So you might need to start with just getting your cat on the cat tree and rewarding, 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 and then focus on the redirection. Once they've learned that they get a reward once they're on that cat tree. The two biggest mistakes that I see people make is number one, they reinforce the wrong behavior. And number two, they don't stay consistent. So remember to have patience with your cat and patience with yourself. Give your cat compassion and give your cat a lot of leniency in the beginning. Be calm, be happy, be positive. Remember, when we are shaping behaviors, we can't be angry about it. We can't reprimand them. It needs to be all super positive and reward focused. I was an autism specialist for 15 years, so behavior has literally been my life for the last 20 years. And behavior modification works across all species. Obviously, there's going to be different variables within that, but I was writing behavior plans for special needs kids for 15 years, and now I write them for cats.